Funny Cave. Five plants that can kill you. Number five, the doll's eye. Also called the white baneberry, the doll's eye is a plant native to eastern North America. The doll's eye's name comes from the fruit of the plant, which is one centimeter in diameter and looks like an eye. The whole plant is poisonous for humans, but the most toxic part is the fruit. The berries affect human cardiac muscles and can easily cause death. Number four, manchineal. These plants are found in Florida, the Caribbean, and Central and South America. The Spanish name is Manzanilla de la Muerte, which means the little apple of death. Ah, now why does death sound so much sexier in Spanish? But it's not just the fruit that's poisonous, the entire tree is actually toxic to humans and animals. Number three, the white snake root. The white snake root is a highly poisonous plant found in North America. It's known for killing humans not directly but indirectly. When the plant is eaten by cattle, a toxin called tremetol is absorbed into their milk and meat. And when humans eat the beef or drink the milk, the toxin enters the body and causes something called milk sickness, which is fatal. Thousands of European settlers died from milk sickness in North America in the early 19th century, including Abraham Lincoln's mother, Nancy Hanks. Symptoms of milk sickness caused by the white snake root plant include violent vomiting, tremors, and abdominal pain. Interestingly, these are the same symptoms you get if you listen to music from the band White Snake. Number two, oleander. The toxins in the oleander plant are so strong that people have actually become sick after eating honey that was made by bees that had visited the flowers. And if eaten, oleander can cause vomiting, diarrhea, seizures, coma, and even death. But fortunately, fatalities from oleander are rare because the plant is very bitter, which acts as a deterrent to anyone who wants to eat it. But then again, you won't find out it's bitter until you actually eat it, and by that time it may be too late. Number one, the castor oil plant. Just like the oleander, castor oil plants can be found in gardens and houses all over the world, even though their seeds are actually very dangerous. In fact, the castor oil plant holds the Guinness World Record for most poisonous plant. Okay, now what I'm going to show you next makes no sense at all, but is absolutely true. So keep that in mind. Now take a look at this chart. On the left side of the chart, we've got different species of animals. On the right side is the number of castor plant seeds needed to kill the animal. So four seeds will kill a rabbit, five to kill a sheep, six to kill a horse, seven for a pig, eight seeds to kill a human, and 11 seeds to kill a dog. And now we get to the duck. How many seeds do you think it takes to kill a duck? Well, since the chart is obviously an increasing order of seeds, it's probably like 12 or 14 or even 17, right? Wrong. No, it takes an average of 80 seeds to kill the lowly duck. That's right, for some reason it takes 80 seeds to kill a duck. And I'm not sure how they figured this out. Well, Steve, it's been 79 seeds. Is that duck still alive? Well, I guess we're going to have to keep feeding that duck more seeds. Well, it's important. It's for science. No, Steve, no. Don't put those in your mouth. No. Well, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you next time. And let me know in the comments, what is your favorite kind of plant? Maybe it's a Venus flytrap or maybe it's a pussy willow. And if you like this video, just go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you didn't like this video, just go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Bye for now.